to the old Lahore. This is the manic part of the city. The one full of culture and full of history. Riding on the back of that motorbike was crazy. But it's so cool to see all of this culture and history. I'm gonna run over the road now. We're gonna try Chenna, which is chickpeas. It's so famous here, so let's go. This is crazy. It's crazy. So the guy who works here just brought over this heart shaped naan. That is so cute. Everyone here is so nice. It's okay, so the first time we're trying Shana. There's so many different varieties of chickpeas in the hall. You can't. I can't name them all, so we're gonna try this one. This looks so good. Look at this one. <laughs> The chickpeas are so creamy and this sauce is not 100% what's in it. It's so good and the oil. That is amazing. It's got just the perfect hit of spices which finish as the oil. Wow. Okay, we're in the heart of the old city of Lahore. This is crazy. All of my senses are just exploding. There's so much to see. So many smells. All of this amazing food. People are so nice here. People are so welcoming. Just got given this dried piece of fruit. So good. This is crazy. I'm deeper into the old city of Lahore. You can see all of these amazing buildings just up behind me but we stopped for some really famous lovely actually here in Lahore this is one of the most famous places this is one of the most famous places you can go to and it opened in 1947 so let's go try some lassi I love it but let's see how good this one is This is ice cream. Uh, mm. Mix it with ice cream. Thank you Don't so mix much. it, you have to eat it like an ice cream. Okay. If you eat it, mix it with the topping, it's very important. The topping is very important. Mm -hmm. so you first have to eat it like an ice cream, then you can drink it later on. Okay, okay I've just stopped with some lassi. This place is so famous. You can see the lassi, but on top, look at these ingredients. It's like lassi ice cream, right? This looks so good. It's like, I think like a biscuity kind of thing. It just melts in your mouth. And this cream is so good.
Welcome to the Wazir Khan Mosque here in Old Lahore. This was built in 1641 by the Mughal Emperor Shah Jahan, same guy who built the Taj Mahal. This is so amazing. Almost 400 years of history still here. You can actually see just behind me that they're actually rebuilding a lot of it because some things are breaking as a 400 year old building would and they're repainting a lot of the original paintings that layer all of the outside you can see all around me the sunlight beautifully hitting this area In the craziness of what is Old Lahore, this really is a sanctuary of peace right here. This place is one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen. All of the hand-painted paintings surrounding the entire complex. Look at this. incredible mosque behind me it's one of the most beautiful places in the city this city is completely the opposite of what I actually thought it would be I had a preconceived idea before I came here that Lahore was just old kind of run down and crazy this part yes is very very busy very amazing and there's also another side of Lahore where it's so modern so built up and so incredible as well, full of sports cars, fancy restaurants, five star restaurants and yeah, I'm having a great time here and yeah, I kind of don't want it to end, it's so amazing.
Okay, you guys, I've just made it to the beautiful Lahore Fort. This was built almost 500 years ago, back in 1545. So, so stunning. You can see all of the original paintings. I'm really excited. Let's go in. So this is the mirror room and when the Mughal Emperor Shah Jahan got married his wife wanted a place where she could see the stars. She apparently was very demanding and she wanted to see the stars all the time so he built this room made of beautiful glass and precious stones so as the sun reflects you can see all of these beautiful areas and when the sun disappeared when they lit candles around this area the candlelight would reflect on all of these beautiful stones and rocks and when the sun comes out right now beautiful my time in northern Pakistan is over. Thank you so much to everyone who has made it the most incredible journey and thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this series and I'll catch you in the south of this incredible country. Stay safe, stay happy and I will see you very very soon.